Hey guys, Hens here. Welcome back for uh, Lands Dungeon Level 2. Uh, yesterday we cleared Level 1 with this setup, so uh, in this one, I'm actually gonna use the same exact setup. Load in Lead, Breaker, Super BB Level 10 with Leg 1, Dual XGX, Medulla Gem, Level 9 SPB, Melchio with Level 10 uh, SPB, Breaker, Sacred Jewel, Michelle with uh, Dandelga, level 9 SPB, and a Saren with uh, Steep Rose. It was the exact same team I used for level 1. Uh, just because I'm feeling adventurous, uh, I'm not gonna go uh, full crit team on this dungeon. And by full crit team, I mean uh, double zebra. So, which uh, actually maximizes the uh, damage output. I'm actually gonna go with semi crit, just like in my previous video. Uh, hopefully, there will be a friend of mine who's also using zebra at the moment, making this video successful. Yeah, yes. Breaker, Medulla Gem, level 10, perfect. So, we we'll use him. Shout out to uh, 7 Up Cell. Thank you for the zebra. And then there's just one little trick I made uh, for this one. Instead of a uh, holy light, I'm using uh, crescent dew. Just in case someone dies, uh, just bring him back. I felt like that was a better alternative than uh, holy light. Because, well, you can only carry three for that. And what are the chances where you have to like heal everyone with something like that? I prefer the revive. So yeah, the others are just staple. Fujin for uh, any type of Raper spam team, especially for crit, and same with uh, Aries Flute. Uh, so without further ado, let's get this started. So it's three battles. Just wanted to make sure so I know uh, how to fully use like my items and my resources. All right, so it's three rounds. So definitely flute. And then this is actually pretty good. We have four units, so chances are we're gonna get our BBs back up. And in that case, we can just fusion for everyone. So definitely SGX for the crit. Michelle for the fire attribute and attack buff. Um, Loden. Well, they are Earth. Huh. <laughs> Actually, we'll just give it to one more. And we'll call it that. So, to ensure that we definitely get our BBs back, we should definitely pop load in. Uh, Zebra doesn't really matter. Uh, Saren doesn't really matter either, except for hit count, but load in is uh, more. Trustworthy, I guess, when it comes to that. And Melchio, we don't need that damage because we have Michelle's uh, attribute buff anyway. So we just get one to load in. And it won't focus on her. Alright, all good, everyone's filled. Perfect. Next round. So two enemies, so that's a the reason why I saved the uh, two Fujin tonics. Cause there's a really high chance we don't get all our, our uh, BBs filled. 
after this, so we need that back up. Uh, since everyone's up, all we need to do is, uh, creepers. Barely made it. So thanks RNG for that. Uh, otherwise, it's probably just one extra turn. Alright, everyone's filled, thankfully. But just in case, we'll pop flute anyway. And. Yeah. like Spark City. <laughs> and I think that's map, yeah. As you guy, uh, guys can see, I didn't use a full crit team, but it'll still crit nonetheless. Semi though. And I managed to uh, complete level 2 without gemming or dying, losing anyone actually, uh, with the same setup. There's the prize. And yeah, all we have left is level 3, which I'll save for tomorrow. Anyways, uh, thanks again for watching guys. Hopefully uh, you learned something from uh, these two videos. And you could uh, basically copy. Not necessarily mimic exactly what I do, uh, but at least get an idea of what to expect. And uh, probably... Some big tips you get out of this is one, um, be aware how many stages uh, in each din uh, each dungeon, and then in those stages, how many uh, enemies you're gonna have to fight. Uh, wise uh, using your items wisely. I was gonna say wise usage, but uh, and yeah, that's basically it. The rest is just RNG. Like everything else, RNG will definitely be part of, so can't really complain about that. But anyways, wish you all luck, and I'll meet you at level 3. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya.